A major announcement for players on the pitch. The U.S. Soccer Federation will now give equal pay to men and women players. Fox 12's Stephanie Domerat is live in studio with the details. Hey, Steph. Hey, good morning. Yeah, this is a historic move for the Federation coming out of a new collective bargaining agreement yesterday. Now, under this agreement, the U.S. will become the first federation in the world to equalize FIFA World Cup prize money. Now, it's a move that players say has been years in the making, and U.S. Federation President Cindy Parlow Cohn says moving forward, both teams will receive the same pay when competing in international matches and competitions. They will split the pool prize money from their respective World Cup appearances, starting with the men this year in Qatar. They will also share commercial and ticket revenue, and Parlo says the move comes thanks to both the men and women teams working together. It's not easy to give up the money that they're giving up, but um, to know that it's the right thing to do and then to step up and do it, um, I think they should be applauded. It just makes it all the more rewarding to to recognize the, the group of individuals that, you know, came together and did this for the first time in history. So really proud of, of our group. Now, this change means the women's team will no longer have guaranteed salaries for some players and will have the same pay-to-play structure as the men's team. And this all comes after a class action lawsuit was settled earlier this year after players from the U.S. women's team filed a gender discrimination suit over equal pay. Now, players and the Federation say they hope this move sets a new tone moving forward. And this new deal will begin June 1st and go through year 2028. The U.S. men's soccer team, by the way, has yet to win a World Cup, while the women's team has won four. In studio, Stephanie Domrat, Shauna and Joe, back to you. All right.